<laughs> so boss. Uh, we've had this LG for since uh, June-ish. It, it is almost your birthday, 10, 11-ish. And uh, give us a part two of this bad boy right here. What, what, what's some of the stuff? I'll watch you work and uh, you can talk about it. Maybe I'll throw this GoPro in there and we'll watch it. So I... I love the machine. I don't. I don't think that I have. Um, I don't think I have any anything really negative to say about it. Um, everything washes really well, and um, it goes well. It comes out well. I think we're out of beads on that box. <laughs> um, smell a little. Anyway, so it's, yeah, it's pretty easy to use. I mean, the most cycles that we always use are like normal heavy duty bedding. Um, I've done deep wash a few times, um, but the other ones I haven't really messed with. You will get, like if you connect it to the app, which I have it connected, you will get um, like monthly notifications that you need to do the, um, the tub clean, which is over here. So you would like turn it on and then you would hit tub clean. And I don't have anything special, so I just pour a bunch of bleach in here. Yeah. It's like up to a cup that you can put in here. And then um, you just would do the tub clean, and it cleans it. And then um, and I think they recommend that every month or every three. I can't remember yeah, exactly how, how long it is. Um, it definitely holds a lot, so... Like you can get carried away filling it, which I don't. I kind of try to keep it to like here, just because everything is heavy. Um, but I feel like it cleans pretty well. I don't have any issues. I haven't pulled anything out and had to put this back in. Um, I don't. I'm trying to think. I don't think there's anything that I don't like about it. You know, every. Every setting when I start it, you'll see, and I think I explained this in the first one, mm. it gives like, you know, what they recommend, but you can change it, which is nice. Um, it has like a time, but the time always changes as it washes. Um, i trying to think. Is there anything I told you that I was like, I wish I did this, I don't think so. Don't no, nothing change. with this. Basically, this is just a sort of a follow up on you know, remember there's seven of us that use this, so this wash machine runs pretty much all day. Yes. All day. Yes. But we're, we're definitely... Several uh, loads a day, that's right. Yeah, sure. yeah, like maybe one day if we're lazy on a weekend or something when we're all home that we're just like, eh, let's go do something else. It might not run or maybe get one load, but literally uh, she runs the pee out of this sucker, runs the dirt out of it, I should say, <laughs> and then... Uh, you know, but we did go with the, uh, from Best Buy when we bought it, we bought the biggest warranty you could get, because I'm sick of fixing stuff, and, uh, yeah, that's just the way it is, so I'll call somebody now if there's an issue with this bad boy, and, uh, we'll roll from there. And the cool thing is, and I, and I didn't try to keep an old machine on it, so I can't really say that it's this one, but Trevor, you know, he works at a cafe, and his clothes are terrible, and I've tried all kinds of different things, just that oil smell. So with this machine, I will do like a deep wash with like vinegar and then our soap. Our soap has, we did videos on it, has like baking soda and all that stuff in it. And it's, it really has helped. And I don't, you know, I'm not, like I said, I'm not saying that it's just the machine, but it does pretty good at cleaning. So that's awesome. Yeah, it's a plus So when you go buy a wash machine. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think people worry because my parents, our other machine didn't have the agitator that came up in the middle. My parents, when they went to go buy a machine like four years ago, the person at Lowe's told them that it won't get clean, as clean if you don't have an agitator. And I really liked not having an agitator, but I kind of understood like what that person was saying because, you know, I mean, that stuff spins the clothes and, you know... And the water. And cleans it. So this one has a mechanism on the bottom that does come up just a little bit. It's not come up all the way. And it really works the clothes around and, um, and cleans them. So that's pretty awesome. So I think that, I think this one 
um, over our Whirlpool because our other one was a Whirlpool that didn't have the agitator. This one definitely cleans a lot better. So um, this is an inverter or a direct drive. Um, I really don't know if that makes a difference, but I noticed that, you know, right. it seems to be a little bit better. All right, I'll let her explain it, and then I'm going to throw the GoPro in for a clean cycle. So I'll edit that, most of it out, and oh. uh, so she'll just turn this back on. Can you just hold that for a second, and then even though it's on normal, you do have to hit this to get all your settings to come up. And then once you have all your settings, you would just hold this to hit play. All right, so hold on Take the muffleness off, putting the barn door back on. This will be left, left side. Okay. Hang it, I think. But the last time it does it, the G Force when it spins, it just it just chucks it against the wall and I lose my crew. So see ya on the other side, guys.